it's an exciting time for our senior players that are moving on. Uh, obviously, they, they were a part of some great things in their career at UNH, and it's accumulation of those things that, you know, as soon as the season ended, they started getting ready for this next step. We had 12 of our players that were working out, all of which had great careers with us. They were great students, great people, and we're all pulling for them. Having all those scouts there, uh, I think, speaks volumes to to the things they accomplished and, and the strides they've made at UNH. Honestly, it was just football. We all trained for a couple months after the loss to Illinois State, you know, we kind of switched our mind to, you know, pro day training. So, you know, it was just going out there and just doing everything we had been doing for the previous two and a half months. It was kind of stressful, but at the same time, you've been doing it for so long, you, you, it's kind of second nature at this point. And the drills, like the 40, the L drill, the shuttle, all that, the on-field drills, like throwing, running routes, that's the stuff we've been good at. It's the stuff we've been doing for the past four and a half years. So it was nice to get out there and just show them what we what were capable of. Go. I was pretty happy with the way I threw. A couple of my times I wish were a little faster, but for the most part I was pretty satisfied with what I did. Obviously the biggest knock uh, since I've got here all my life pretty much has been my 40 time running, my speed. And last spring we did a junior day, and at the junior day I ran, and I ran a 4.76 I believe. So then went through the season, you know, Went down to Florida, trained, and then after the training, I came back, and at the pro day, one of the scouts times, there was a 4.49. So that was pretty cool, just seeing all the, the training and all the work that I put in for two and a half years just come to fruition and work out there at the pro day. Obviously, you're hoping to do the best you can, but say you don't run the time you want, or you make a bad throw, or you drop a ball, you just gotta keep going. I feel like everyone uh, had a good day. We just went out there and proved that just because we come from a little school like UNH, FCS, we're still able to get out there and compete and play with the top guys in the NFL. From the 29-yard line, Andy to throw again, looking for RJ, end zone, touchdown! It's really a business at the next level, so some guys' measurables don't fit into a certain system, where other guys will. The Pro Day helped me get my name out there and just come in contact with a couple scouts, and hopefully it leads to maybe a tryout, even just a day. I mean, I just want to be able to put the helmet on at least one more time, whether it's in a practice or what. I mean. That's all I'm really asking for. It's out of my hands. I can just control what I can control, you know, working out, staying in shape, being in the best shape of my life. So just in case something does happen for me, I'm ready to go. We'll fly on the radar, but if you give us the opportunity, we can shock the world.